Hello everybody. Welcome to CWL Racing. Still season one and our second round of it. And we are going to introduce the racers. First, we had a 2014 Corvette Stingray versus Rogue Next, we have Retroactive versus G7827. Next, we have the Torque Twister versus Twinduction. Next, we have the 2008 Lance Revolution versus Rolara LX. 2008 Lance Revolution and Rolara LX were the tiebreaker losers. So, we needed another one to go to the finals. And if we, if we didn't have them go, we would have to have only three racers to move on to the last round. Here are the racers for the first race. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the Rogue wins and the 2014 Corvette Stingray will crash. And here are the second racers. Set, go. And it looks like G7827 will come out with the win. While the retroactive crashes. And here are the next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like Twinduction wins while Torque Twister crashes and the emergency team is on site to help Torque Twister. And here are the next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like Rolara LX will come out the, with the win. And the 2008 Lancer Evolution will crash. And it looks like the 2008 Lancer Evolution really knows how to back into a parking spot. And here are the next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the 2014 Corvette Stingray will win the race. Our next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like barely G7827 will win and Retroactive will lose. And here are our next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like both of them crash and they might have came off track. And we have an emergency. And it looks like we have an emergency. And here are our next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the 2008 Lancer Evolution will crash and the Rolara LX will win this race. And it looks like we have an emergency. And it looks like we have a second emergency. This is the halfway point recap. And the 2014 Corvette Stingray will come out with one and the Rogue Cog with also one. The, the Retroactive will come out with one and G7827 will come out with one also. Torque Twister will have one point and so will Twinduction. And the 2008 Lancer Evolution will have zero points while Rolara LX will have two. And here are our next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the, the, the 2014 Corvette Stingray will come and win while the Rogue Hog will crash and come right back onto the track. And these are our next racers. Set, go. And it looks like 
G7827 will win and retroactive will crash on the track. We have an emergency. And here are our next racers. Ready, set, go. And it looks like Twin Duction will crash. And Tort Twister will win. Here are the next racers. And the 2008 Lancer Evolution. This is a must win for him. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the 2008 Lancer Evolution will not move on. And the Rolara LX will automatically move on. We are going to recap the rules for this track. So, we have the Rogue Hog landing farther but not on their wheels. But the 2014 Corvette Stingray landing on their wheels. You have to go farther than the 2014 Corvette Stingray. The Rogue Hog does. And they have to land on their wheels because of the 2014 Corvette Stingray landing on their wheels. The Rogue Hog didn't, so the 2014 Corvette Stingray will if win. If they both don't land on their wheels, the one that goes the farthest will win. And here are the next racers. And the 2014 Corvette Stingray will go first. Ready, set, go. It looks like the 2014 Corvette Stingray goes past the table, but does not land on their wheels. Ocog will go next. Ready, set, go. And it looks like the Rogue Hog will not go farther by a hair, but he will land on his wheels, so the Rogue Hog wins. These two have split their races, and they will go to a tiebreaker match. Here are our next racers. And Retroactive will go first. Ready, set, go. It looks like... He will land on his wheels. G7827 will go next. Ready, set, go. It looks like he hits him and that forces him to go backwards and that means retroactive will win. And these two split the races, so we will go to a tiebreaker match. These are our next racers. Port Twister will go first. Ready, set, go. Torque Twister goes onto the Hot Wheels track. And he will slide down and land on his wheels. Twin Duction will go next. Ready, set, go. It looks like he will go farther and he will land on his wheels. So we will... Go to a tiebreaker and match. Laura LX is already moving on to the next round, but will still be racing in the last track. Yeah, they're Alara LX going first. Ready, set, go. It looks like he she goes pretty far, but will not land on her wheels. 2008 Lancer Evolution has already been eliminated, but we will still race him. Ready, set, go. It looks like he doesn't go farther, and he does not land on his wheels. So the Rolara LX will win another one. And the first tiebreaker races are the 2014 Corvette Stingray versus Rokoff. like barely the Rogue Hog will win by a hair and the 2014 Corvette Stingray will be eliminated. For the second race on the tiebreaker track we have Retroactive versus G7827.
like both of them will get in the same lane, so we will change that. Ready, set, go. And it looks like G7827 will win and Retroactive will be eliminated. The last race on our tiebreaker track. We have Twin Duction versus Torque Twister. We will be shortly back while we clean up that track. And it looks like the shark will come up and Twin Duction is in the shark's mouth. And we will have a redo. I think we'll win. And these will be the semi-finals races in, a in another video. First, we have Rokog versus G7827. And we have Torque Twister versus Velara LX. Thank you for watching CWL Racing. Goodbye.